The military's toughest training courses offer many challenges to those selected to attend them. Army Ranger School is one such course. Tech Sergeant Christian Varela from the 78th Security Forces Squadron took on that challenge. Yeah, I completed Ranger School. Um, after that, I was uh, the only Security Forces member at the time. Um, uh, there was uh, some TAC-P as well there. Um, but yeah, it's a rare opportunity. Uh, definitely grateful for the opportunity. It gets me to see a different perspective on uh, leadership approaches and leadership styles. Though we got through the training, there were bumps in the road. Uh, I got there in July, 29th actually. Um, I in processed and uh, they kicked me back because my medical paperwork wasn't uh, completed correctly. Uh, they got me another slot in uh, November, uh, which I was trying to avoid because it's the winter time, so nobody wants to go through ranger school in the winter time. Uh, but I went back in uh, November, um, and yeah, the first week is your uh, first five days, which is called rap week. That's where uh, typically everyone fails out of. Um, that was probably the hardest time, uh, simply because it was a new environment. Sergeant Varela had this to say about being the only Air Force member in his class. Being the only Air Force guy on the first day, uh, I was put in a leadership position. I was a class leader for uh, over about 250 uh, personnel. So being the only Air Force guy, my nickname became uh, Air Force slash chair force um, and yeah from that point on I was expected you know to perform. Moving on we went to a mountain phase and that's that was the kicker right there for me. Um, mountain phase is in uh, Dahlonega, Georgia uh, you know and the cold is a little bit different over there. Um, it can be 40 degrees in the training site and once we shoot out to do our FTX it could drop 10 to 15 degrees immediately. You add wind on there and rain. It's a pretty horrible experience. Once I completed mountain phase, I went on to uh, Florida, which is your swamps phase. And um, I will admit, I was pretty terrified myself. Uh, I'm not the greatest in the water, uh, but I definitely you know, can hold my own, obviously. Um, but the swamps terrified me. I mean, you're, you're going through the swamps with your ruck. Sometimes you're carrying a 240 machine gun that weighs 30 pounds plus your gear. Um, so it's pretty intimidating, you know, uh, getting sunk into the swamps uh, with, with all the gear and being expected to complete missions. For Robbins Air Force Base, I'm Paul Wenzel.